Hi Psychic America, this is Tracy Brown coming to you today. Uh, I think it's the 21st. I don't remember, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to post it. Um, coming to you today on the 21st. Um, this is on Drake. 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 <laughs> Drake. Drake. Um, I've been avoiding doing you. I don't know why. I think because you have a problem with Chris Brown. I think it's personal. Because <laughs> um, I like Chris Brown. Um, but I guess it's time to do you, Drake. You're up for a psychic review. So, Drake, you had a concert. You're on this big tour. and I think it's your first big tour, right? Like you're headlining. And then you have Miguel. And then you have Future. Um, what's the problem with you and Future? Because the concert canceled the other day. And we heard that it had something to do with some stupid catwalk. What are you, a bunch of girls? What are you doing? What do you mean it was supposed to be a catwalk? There's a stage. Do your job. Sing your songs. It's really a catwalk? Oh, my God. I'm so irritated right now. But in any case, I want to see why your show got canceled. And I think it got canceled for two days in a row. Take a look at that. I'm only going to do one reading today because I have this huge headache. Um, but let me remind you that I work out of the Green Man store. The telephone number here is 818-985-2010. 818-985-2010. Um, and so call me for your own personal readings. Also, I'm going to be doing uh, Skype readings. How fun. Um between the hours of 11 and 7 Pacific, Pacific. So, all those that want to Skype your reading, bring it on. Let's do that. <laughs> um, Psychic Tracy Brown is my name. So, friend me, and then we'll move forward from there. 15-minute readings um, on Skype, just to start. All right? And I'm not playing with my hair. <laughs> Drake, what the hell happened? Oh, my God, you're such a girl. Drake, you're a girl, but you kind of know that, don't you? You're a girl, and your antics are ridiculous, but you're very, very talented, so kind of make the talent come through more than all these antics that are, you know, this, this boy stuff, even though you act like a girl. Oh, please, Drake fans, don't be mad at me. I really don't care. He acts like a girl. Who canceled a concert because of a catwalk? What is wrong with you people? You boys, stop. Three of you, none of you can perform? Ugh, so annoyed. Why did Drake cancel the show? Let's figure that out. I'm going to find out. I'm only doing this one video, so let's make it good, Drake. Let's see your personality come out. Eight, nine. Get good. Ten. Oh, God, it's such a headache. Hmm. Well, first thing I'm getting is that if you keep up these antics, you're going to lose a lot of money. People are going, not going to have faith in you. Um, and it works really, really bad for your future. So, with that being said, it was a boy-on-boy -boy issue. It was you and probably future. I'm not really seeing Miguel in the middle of this. I, I, I don't see Miguel actually in the middle of this. Between you and another boy, actually, I do see Miguel. I think Miguel <laughs> is on future side. Yep, that's the way I see it. I think it's two boys against one. Um, um, personalities are, are spicy. Um, they want, you know what, Drake? I got to tell you, these two boys that are um, on your tour, I don't know who decides that. I think it is a really good tour. I don't know who decides it, but these two boys want to make you look bad. They want to make you either look like a girl or look like you cost them money, cost the um, label money, and they're going to get their way um, because you don't know what they're doing. Um, and they're antagonizing you pretty much the way you did. Oh, I get it. It's payback. Pretty much the way you did Chris Brown. That's what I'm getting. That's what I'm getting, folks. Um, yeah. Be careful because if this tour.
continues to have problems, this could be your last tour, Drake. So you would have to sell records like you can't imagine, and they still wouldn't put you on tour anywhere. They certainly won't allow you to headline anymore. Um, you're a sensitive kind of guy. You're very sensitive. Drake, <laughs> use your head. Use your head. I'm getting you're a lot smarter than what's being portrayed. Unfortunately, it's not showing up. Use your head, Drake. Um, they're actually playing with you. They're playing with you. They're playing with your money. They actually don't want uh, you to be successful. I think the boys are a little resentful. Could I be that long? I don't know. I think that they're resentful that you're headlining. Um, so, with that being said, you have to be smarter than them. And canceling a tour, oh, by the way, I do feel like that there was some uh, f facial stuff. I do feel like that there was a fight and that maybe you had some injury to your face. Has anybody seen a picture of Drake lately since he canceled the tour? Yeah, you probably won't because I think he's hiding out because I think he might have got punched in the face. That's what I'm getting. That's what I'm getting. That's why I had to get canceled. Um, in any case. Another question I need to ask for one of my uh, Twitter people, and I apologize for taking this long to, to answer the question. Um, it's just sometimes when I do too many readings, it gets like all confusing. Is Drake dating Nikki? Or did he? Did he? Did Drake date Nikki? Are they even friends? Because there's a possibility that they could have dated. Um, and I, it doesn't look like it ended well. So I don't know this Nikki Drake stuff. Um, so I don't know if there's any problems with them, but I can tell you that if they did, I'm getting that they did, um, there was a lot of conflicts. 